I'm at the University of Oxford and here is one of these liver perfusion units which has been used now for the first time to transplant a liver at body temperature and with me to discuss that is an engineer here, Professor Konstantin Kousios. Professor, can you simply explain how does this work? This changes the paradigm for organ preservation. Organs are traditionally preserved cold in a refrigerated state. This effectively replicates the body environment at normal body temperature. So the liver goes here? The, the organ is placed here and effectively we have a pump that replicates the function of the heart, an oxygenator that replicates the function of the lungs and a series of infusion that provide the chemicals normally present within the body. The idea being that this organ here never knows it has actually left it. Now what are the benefits there for the organ and ultimately for the patient who receives that organ? So we believe that the organ by being um, flown with blood normally um, um, actually has a chance by not going through a, a hot cold hot transition of functioning better the instant it is put back in the patient. But the most important feature of this device is that the organ is functioning normally during the preservation period. And so as a result, we are able to assess how well it's working before transplanting it. Do you hope it might mean more livers will be available for transplant in future? Absolutely. About half of the organs currently available in the UK within current donation practices come from riskier, marginal donors. And we believe that these organs can be both improved and most importantly assessed on this device. Therefore, we could as much as double organ preservation within current donation practices. And your first patient doing very well? First patient doing very well, shortest possible time I could have hoped for for recovery.